Hello, Cousin Mary and Jean. Wearing a t-shirt from my favorite restaurant. This place called Free Birds in Clear Lake. And what it is, it's kind of sort of healthy Mexican. You go and you get these bowls of, of every vegetable known to Mexican cuisine and you fill it up and you eat it. It's very, very good. I stop there whenever I deal with my computer stuff, which has been a lot lately. So this morning I'm just lounging around like usual. The weather is really funky. Uh, I it got up, to, it's supposed to get up to 80 and then it's supposed to go down to 50 this evening or for tomorrow morning. So who knows what the weather is going to do. Not I. I hate to admit it, but I've gotten entrenched in the news again, which could be another reason my being is waning into nothingness. But, um, God, it's so scary what's going on. And I can't imagine people are letting it happen. <laughs> but who am I? And like you said, it doesn't matter. I mean, it really doesn't matter. There's nothing I can do. So people will say, oh, yes, yeah, there it. <laughs> do it. <laughs> Go, knock yourselves out. So I've got to try to wean myself off the news again. Uh, today, I was going to try to go through some of my videos and see if I had anything worthy of a video instruction piece or anything I can use. Yesterday, I officially decided to keep my new laptop. I love this thing. I um, went ahead and put the Adobe Premiere Elements on it and didn't bog down. The other one bogged down as soon as that was installed. But that's good. Um, Cindy and I are playing video games last night. So we're trying to outdo each other with our, what's it called? Is it hate? No, it's Wild West Frontier um, with the Windows games. So it's got the best graphics I have ever seen. I mean, you can rotate it, look at it from every angle. You can even peer into the windows. It's pretty cool. It's amazing to me how they can create such graphics on to a game like that and then program it into the computer so that you can see what the artist intended you to see. It's pretty cool. Pretty cool beans. So Peppy's not doing so well. He's getting real lethargic and he's coughing all the time and he's starting to, Peppy's the dog. <laughs> And he's starting to lay around a lot, so I think his time is coming. He's got congenital heart failure, I guess that's what you call it, and he's in the last stages. So I look at it, he's had a great life. We've had him since 2000, 2004, something like that. So he's had a good long life, and I think he had a good life before then. Can't say that about most pets. Most pets have been chained in backyards and abused. So I feel that he's been pretty fortunate and we're trying to keep him comfortable. So it's kind of sad, but Cindy's sadder than I am. I usually wait until it happens and I'm, ah! um, I've had a lot of animals. I did a lot of animal rescue and learned that, you know, if they've had a good home, they've got a lot more than most pets, unfortunately. So, Hope your day is going well. Hope you were able to get some rest, and I hope you don't run yourself to death. I will talk to you later. Sayonara.